this is the new Let's Play. You can already tell what the game is by the title of the video. I already recorded 20 minutes of this, but my recorder didn't like having 20 minutes recorded at once, so um, it exploded and died. Yeah, it didn't, it didn't save the recording. It, uh, yeah, that was my old file. I'll have to erase that data and try again. Because, oh wait, I need to show you the beginning cutscene. Goddamn, I'm sorry, it went so good at the beginning, but now... Uh, let's try this again, I hope the sound is better too. Because, yeah. This is my new way of recording sound, hopefully. Come on, there we go, there we go, there we go. Let's pretend the failure never happened. Ahem, today, I'm going to tell you the story of the Thousand Year Door. An awfully long time ago, in a strange and far off land, a big bustling town thrived. It was a town where all people lived very happy lives, and it was said that the town was very prosperous. But one day, tragedy befell this blessed place. A great cataclysm struck the town and its people. Darkness filled the skies, and the earth roared and shook. It was as if the very world had come to a violent end. In but a single night, the town sank into the depths of the earth. Many moons rose and set. Stories of the town passed into the pages of fairy tales, and when the town site no longer held relics of its past, people gathered at that spot and built a new town. But word soon spread among the people who moved in, that an ancient city lay deep underground, and that a magnificent treasure rested there. Indeed. This is the tale of the fabled treasure of Rogueport. Yes, this is where it begins in the sea town of Rogueport. The tale of the quest for the legendary tre treasure in the Thousand Year Door starts here. Dun 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 dun. Epic music, I don't know. <sighs> oh well. Finally, I have a minute without Toadsworth watching over me. He's so paranoid. I come all the way here on holiday only to be stuck with Toadsworth. It's so stifling. Once in a while, I'd like the chance to look around on my own and see what I want. But now that I'm doing it, all I see is that this town has a very, um, distinct flavor. Oh, Missy, Missy. Do you mean me? Yes, you, Missy. Won't you buy something? I have a wide assortment of knickknacks and doodads. Oh, well, um... Well, that's a pretty box. What's inside it? It is said that this box holds a map that shows where the le where legendary treasure sleeps, but the box has a magic lock on it and will only open for a pure and noble heart. As you can see, it won't so much as budge if one such as myself touches it. Wow, that's blunt. Oh. I know, if the box will open for you, Missy, then you may have whatever is inside. I'm sure that whatever is in there would be of no use to someone like me. So, Missy, take this box in your hands and see what happens. Um, alright, what's the harm? I'll try to open it. And of course it opens for her. Because she's Princess Peach. Goddamn. Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door. Okay, now let's start. <sighs> I can't believe my recording crapped out on me. I recorded so much. I guess I won't be recording more than one episode at a time like I thought I could. Okay, anyways. This is not the name Mario will go by. Mario will always be Mario. It's just the name of the file, so you can remember whose file is whose. You know. When you have more than one family member, whatever. <laughs> this is Mario's house. Let's state the obvious. And there is a Paracoupa. 
I think that's what they're called. Whatever, you know what I mean. Mail call. I'm not going to be giving Luigi or Mario Italian accents because I cannot do accents. So I'm just going to voice them normally. I'm not really going to try to voice them that much because I can't do male voices because, yeah, whatever. Hey, bro, check it out. A letter from Princess Peach arrived for you. I'll just read it to you. How does that sound? Ahem, now let's see here. Hello there, Mario. I am now on holiday, traveling in the Mushroom Kingdom. In my travels, I came into possession of a mystical map. A treasure map, actually. It was inside a box I got from an old merchant in a town called Rogueport. But since it would be too difficult for me to try to go find treasure all by myself, I thought you could help me hunt for it. You will, of course, won't you? I've included the map with this letter, so please, 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 please bring it with you when you come. I'll meet you at Rogueport. That means you must come. Peach. What do you know? It's true. There's a weathered old map in here with the letter. Check it out. Not not. Look at that map. It makes a lot of sense, don't it? <laughs> Fuck that. And now I'm on a boat to, guess where, a rogue port. Paper Mario, the thousand year door. Yeah, 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 I know. Let's go. Loading. <laughs> and here we go, and... Prologue. A rogue's welcome. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Please wake up, sir. The town you've been speaking of has come into view. Look, that's Rogueport. <gasps> Gasp. Rogueport. You see, we'll arrive shortly. Please prepare to disembark. Okay, I will. Oh, this looks like a very wonderful place. Ugh. Ha, huh, look at our boat. That's awesome. I must apologize, sir. Our arrival was delayed just a bit by rough weather. Are you quite sure you want to disembark here? I did tell you all the sordid tales about Rogueport on our way here, did I not? What's that? I'm sorry, you say there's a princess waiting here for you? Is that so? Uh, of course, sir. Well, if that's what you think, then I won't stop you. But, uh, you be careful, sir. Don't say I didn't warn you. Well, hello there, Rogueport. I'm gonna save and end it for now because I don't want it to crash like last time. Yeah, yeah, I know this is a save block. Da -da -da, your progress is saved. And I hope you keep watching, and I'll probably upload another video today, so I'll see you later.